I do want to get chased though, but it looks like that's not happening right now. Man, come on. Oh, fuck! <sighs> Hello and welcome back to another Adept video. Today we have Ace Visconti. One of his perks is open handed. Strengthens the potential of you and your teammates or uh, reading abilities by six meters uh, I know it's tier two, but as you can see I do not have that much blood points right now and uh, Yeah, if it was tier three it would be eight meters and uh, So say if somebody does have a map they can see whatever object they're looking for further and This also goes really well with kindred. So Yeah, his second perk up the ante for each other survivor still alive, grant a 2% bonus of luck to all remaining survivors out of 3%. And his third perk, Ace in the Hole. When retrieving an item from a chest, there is a 100% chance that a very rare or lower add-ons will be attached to it. And yeah, 50% chance of finding an add-on of uncommon rarity or lower. When escaping, keep the add-ons your item has. That's pretty much his perks. Uh, they get to see auras further from each other and luck. Uh, but yeah, yeah, I'm gonna bring in a bloody party streamer because I need the points and a first aid kit with a styptic agent because I do not plan on going down right off the bat. And uh, yeah, I'm just gonna see how this goes. All right, we are in the shelter woods. Don't know why I said it like that. I'm just preparing myself to get fucked this game. That is corrupt. All right, let's do this, Jen. No ruin this game. Woo, there's a close one, dude. There's a close one. Showing me the legs and whatnot. Liking it. That is bamboozle, hell yeah. Look, listen. Oh, there's no way. Look. All right, we're in Disturbed Ward. So look, I decided to put on the Jar of Salty Lips, you know why? Because it grants me, uh, I believe, another 5% uh, luck. So I, uh, that stacks with my up the ante. So that is 7% 7, 7 overall, I think. Oh no, wait, for up the ante, I think it, it grants me 2% luck for each remaining survivor in the game. So I think that's two, four, six. Eight, right? I believe it's eight just for having that perk. Uh, it is tier two, so if it was tier three, it would be 12. And then Jar of Salty Lips would stack on with that. So I will attempt to escape from the hook only once because I do not trust it still, but yeah. All right, that's the first gen. Whoa, what is this? Oh, oh, what? Huh? Oh my god, dude. Okay, so this guy might get me, so I'm just gonna attempt once, and here we go. Okay, maybe one more. Oh, so close. Borrow time, though. There's no way he's coming after me again, is he? Yeah, don't you worry. Don't you worry. I didn't even hear them yell. What the hell? All right. Hell meh. So if, for the later adept videos, I was wondering if I should use the default clothing still or if I like, is it okay to like change my clothes? I don't know. I'd like to keep the default clothes on because in a way it's kind of like tradition to the adept videos kind of thing but people are different and uh i like to stick with like you know in the original the original clothings but let me know if it doesn't matter or anything and yeah i do have a lot of like ideas for other videos and i wanted to make a compilation video of just like random moments of like this game or or other games i was uh 
Like, I, I'm thinking of, like, playing other games, too, but not right now. But just giving you guys a heads up. Yeah, but right now, what I play offline, uh, what I mean by offline is, like, like not recording or anything. I usually play, like, Black Ops 4 kind of thing and, like, um, like Black Ops 3 Zombies, specifically. And, like, World War Z, stuff like that. Because, you know, why not? A little bit of Fallout Guys, too, or whatever that game is. Just a little bit. But never Fortnite, though. Never Fortnite. Don't like Fortnite. Seen it, done it, and don't like it. It's too colorful for me, you know? Fortnite is just too colorful. That's not me. Alright. I'm gonna go into... Oh, I'll just do this gen. Why not? I do want to get chased, though. But it looks like that's not happening right now. Man, come on. Oh, fuck! Okay, I'm just gonna go over here. He probably heard that. It's gonna run now. Oh! Oof, that was a close one. And... <laughs> he didn't even want me, okay. There's like no chance this game, there's no chance. I don't know why I'm trying anymore. Definitely no chance. Why did he look so weird there? What the hell? He didn't even look like Ace. He just looked like some, like, guy who lost all his money off of a bid in the casino or something. <laughs> and then he, like, I don't know. <laughs> Everyone does keep going down real quick fast. I mean, I, I was one of them, but I learned from my mistakes, though. And, of course, he's going to come up here, right? I know he's up there. Oof. Bitch, I hope the fuck you do! Where's that? Oh. Ah ha ha! Well, that person's super dead. Whoa, how did you know? How did you know? You're, you're hacking. You're hacking. That's the only way he knows. Oh, look, I'm just going to jump through that and then loop around again. Oh, oh, oh okay. Didn't know that was going to happen. Why? Look at that. <laughs> it, was an, it was a good attempt, though. It was a good attempt. Yeah, I mean, I don't think I'm going to be able to do two gens while that guy's getting chased. At some point, he's going to go down right away. And I spoke too soon. I hope he picks up, though. Okay, I'm just going to stay in here. All right. Oh, he missed that. <gasps> Is he? Oh, he's actually giving it to me. Oh, my. Well, thank you, kind sir. I like that. He's a good killer. <laughs> 
All right, let's see what we have. Just like that. I, like, if it wasn't for the killer, though, I don't think I would have got it all. But GG's to everyone in the game. I'm gonna give that five stars. Oh, fuck yeah! All right, see you guys in the next one. Peace.